So what is inheritance? Inheritance in SharePoint and inheritance in life is quite similar. It means that if I have a trait in a object, this object will actually inherit it from its parent. So if I'm in a site now in SharePoint and this site has subsite or even sub object if we wish because a site may have a document library, may have a pages library. So if I go to site content, let's have a look at this. We have some objects. All these objects have specific permission, but they may inherit by default. They always inherit the permission of the site itself. So it means that in Europe, I gave access to maybe all my employees. This site is accessible by all the employees. All the objects inside will be accessible by all the employees. Now, if I go to subsite, I have some sub object. Each site here may be accessible by all the employees as well. That's usually the default, but I can always stop that. So I can go into the site itself. I will go into the site content, site settings, site permission, and then I will stop the permission because I will say you will not have the same permission as the parent. You will have permission specific to this country. So permission in SharePoint is super important because if I go into a subsite now, I can go at very, very deep level. So here I have a library. This library can have a specific permission. The document inside can have a specific permission. If I had a folder, this folder will have a specific permission, etc., etc. So I can have site, subsite, 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 then library inside, list as well, and each list item may have a specific permission. And an item being a row, like this one, this is a, f um, a file, but it works the same with list and item. We can have specific permission. So that's fantastic because I can give access to just this item, top secret. The user doesn't have to have access to the whole site, but he would still be able to access only this thing. Of course, he will need to be given the, the link. So I hope this clarification of permission is useful for some of you who asked me the question before.